Alright, cool. Alright, Glad Rap Channel here with Patrick Ferguson who flew all the way from the US. So, uh, when did you arrive in New Zealand? I got here Wednesday night. Wednesday yeah, night, okay. Wednesday night. You had time to, you know, get used to the, the conditions and... Oh yeah, yeah, it was pretty easy, you know. Right when I got here, it was time to go to bed, so, you know, it was easy. Okay. So, uh, do you know much about, you know, Panuve Helu? Like, he's, he's quite renowned here in, uh, you know, in the local scene. Uh, he's like the big bad boy of, of the boxing, uh, you know, New Zealand boxing. Have you heard much about him? Or I haven't heard much about him, but I, I've seen a fight and he's pretty impressive. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So he, I think he has 10, 10 wins, uh, one loss, but you know, 10 of the wins are by, 9 of them are by knockout. So, and you got quite a fierce record as well, so 12 wins and I think 10 are knockout? Yeah, about 10 or 10. Yeah, about so 10 So it's, it's looking like it's going to be quite a, quite a explosive fight. Oh yeah, it'll, it'll be action packed for yeah. sure. How do you see it? How do you see it going? I see, um, like I said, it's going to be action packed. It's going to be a lot of uh, exciting moments, and um, and it's just going to be really, it's going to be exciting. Okay. Yeah. Um, do you know much about Heli? Like, have you have you seen him on YouTube, or have you seen any of his fights? Or yeah, yeah, I've seen I've seen some of his uh, I've seen some of his fights, and like I said, he's ex he's exciting. He's um he's got a really interesting style. He's got that kind of uh, that kind of crowd raising style. So I think it's going to be a, a great fight. You know he's faced he's faced uh, some 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 good opponents, but sort of I don't know. I mean the opponents that you faced have uh, sort of battle tested. Um, do you think you're you kind of his first real test? Well, you know, I can't. I, I don't really. I don't really know because I don't know who he's who he's fought. But I'm definitely gonna be um, one of his toughest challenges for sure. Yeah. 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 Um, so how did you how did you get into boxing? Like, uh, were your parents in it or? No, you know, I just uh, I wanted to stay in shape and I wanted some discipline for my life. And uh, a friend of mine, a friend of mine, um, was into boxing. He said, "Hey, man, let's try this out." So that's it. Were you good right from the start? Or did you sort of have oh, to? Hell no, man. Huh? No, I got, yeah, I got, you know, I got beat up, but I got used to it. I came back and back, and um, you know, developed my skill, and you know, and that's it. Did you have a amateur background? Yeah, I, I fought. Um, I was a, uh, I was an amateur national champion, heavyweight champion. Uh, I competed in the Olympic trials, so I, I had a decent amateur career. And uh, you know, being from the U.S., like uh, you, you fought all around the U.S. or uh, you know, in particular areas. Yeah, yeah, I fought, I fought all around the U.S. Yeah. Have, you, have you ever trained at, you know, TMT, like, uh, you know, uh, Floyd Mayweather's gym? And no, I haven't been to Mayweather's gym. No. Is, is, is he one of your influences? I mean... Um, uh, yeah, I think Mayweather is, is an influence for any fighter, you know, to be just renowned like that and, and, and watch his skill develop and get better and better. Um, yeah, definitely an influence. Are there other, any other influences, you know, in, in your boxing career? Uh, yeah, I love, the, I love the older guys, uh, Holyfield and... Tyson and, um, and just watching those those fights like that. Do you try and like sort of adopt some of their styles when, when you fight? Like, uh, who would you say you most sort of, um, you know, sort of base your style on? <coughs> um, you know, I, I couldn't say. I couldn't say. Um, so about tomorrow, you know, uh, Wild Boy <laughs> Helu. Uh, did you see him at the way and how did he look? Did he look in shape? Did, did he look ready for battle? Uh, he looked. He looked. Uh, yeah, he looked confident. He looked serious. So he looks. Yeah, he looks good. Looks did, good. did you see any nerves in his eyes or any of that? Um, no. You know, he kept his kept his composure. So yeah, he looks looks pretty good. So uh, is there anything on the line tomorrow? Like, is there is this your, your belt on the line or? Yeah, there's a there's a belt there's a belt on the line. I'm not really sure which one, but. Okay. And is this your first time fighting in New Zealand? Yeah, this is my first time. Okay. So. so first time fighting sort of overseas or? No, no. Okay. Uh -huh. So you, you fought you fought um, in Australia anywhere anywhere we no, know? They, no, the only place overseas I fought is uh, in in Ghana, Africa. Okay, what was that like? Yeah, it was great. The people are great. You know, it's a beautiful place. I had a tough fight though. I had a, um, a draw with a really tough fighter. So yeah, I'm hoping to go back and. Uh, and get that win soon. And uh, just yeah, just come on. Yeah. So um, tomorrow, how do you think the fight is gonna go? So what do you think? Like, what's your prediction? You know, I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna just do. The, you know, I'm gonna go hard and, and give the fans what they want to see. Like I said, it's gonna be action packed, but um, you know, hoping to end it pretty soon. So you think it's gonna be a knockout? Yeah. In the in the early rounds, you think? Yeah, I think.
Yes. Awesome. And just tell people where they can follow you, man. Um, you can find me on Instagram at uh, Patrick F. Ferguson. You can find me on Facebook. The same, Patrick Ferguson. Boom. Awesome. Thanks for your time, champ. And uh, all the best for tomorrow, man. Awesome. Thanks. See you, man.